What's been missing, of course, is the interface between the real world and the simulated world. I really felt like it was messing with my senses and taking me somewhere else. But the thing that science fiction never shows us is the set of tools, the infrastructure that gets us there. PC-based virtual reality is incredible. The graphics are amazing, but it's the positional tracking that really immerses you. But what if you didn't need a PC? Bridge is a new headset designed specifically for the iPhone. With an onboard structure sensor, Bridge unlocks full inside-out positional tracking. No high-end PC, no markers, and no external cameras. Unlike existing mobile VR, where all you can do is look around, with Bridge, you'll be free to actually move. Bridge even brings the real world into view automatically, helping you avoid obstacles. Oh man, this is so badass. I thought it was amazing to see a, a standard cell phone do this kind of mixed reality. Bridge comes with a Unity plugin, so you can easily upgrade your projects with these new capabilities. Plus, you can still use existing iPhone VR apps in rotation-only mode. But we didn't stop with virtual reality. Bridge can actually sense the world around you, and we use this to enable something unprecedented. Full mixed reality, all on an iPhone. With Bridge, you could visualize new furniture, practice keeping a garden, create a portal to anywhere in the world, or bring the world to you. You can experience the virtual and the real at the same time in a way that bridges the essential gap between the augmented reality of the past 10 years and the mixed reality experience of the next 10. To make all of this possible on the iPhone, we had to create a completely new software engine for mobile mixed reality. We call it Bridge Engine. We engineered Bridge Engine from the ground up to run in real time, completely on device, with no external processing. Immersive mixed reality requires a wide view of the world, so we designed a custom glass lens that doubles the iPhone's field of view. Bridge Engine fuses this view with 3D sensor data, displaying a unique image to each of your eyes. Bridge Engine is capable of powering amazing creations, like Bridget, our curious little robot companion. Bridget can already do some incredible things, like navigate around obstacles, play fetch, and even interact with real objects. We'll collaborate with the developer community to teach Bridget more about the world. In fact, we're making Bridget's high-level functions open source, and developers can use them in their own projects. Bridget, the little robot, popped up and she kind of walked around a footstool. And, and it's something that's really hard to do. I think most people probably don't realize that. Just for the ability to move from, from point A to point B, you need to know what the map looks like around you, where there are obstacles, so you can navigate around these things. And I was, I was just shocked that it worked so well. The first ideas for Bridge were sketched in 2014, and we've been obsessing over the details ever since. For example, we chose to use lightweight anodized aluminum for precision alignment of the optics. We developed a magnetic system that holds bridge securely shut, yet is easily opened. And we designed a bike helmet inspired ratchet to easily adjust fit while simultaneously improving weight distribution. The industrial design is good, the optical design is good, certainly your camera is magic. The bridge headset felt like it was a product uh, five, ten years into its evolution. Join us. Get a Bridge headset. Our limited Explorer edition for developers is being assembled now and will ship in a matter of days. Here's what you'll get. A Bridge headset, complete with structure sensor, a Bluetooth controller, access to Bridge Engine and our Unity plugin, and of course, Bridget. At Occipital, we've always wanted to help shape the future of computing. Bridge is part of our effort to do just that, and it builds on everything we've done to date. We hope you'll join us on the frontier of this strange and fantastic new world. Well, yeah, I have a closing statement. I want one. How soon can I get it? <laughs>